Well, um, this board um, This is my quiz app. That's what I want to show you now. So I'm just going to start it up for now. First is going to be a splash screen. Um, that's going to take me into the app. So it loads, it comes up. Um, there's the splash screen and there's the home page. So first I'm going to take you through um, just the first the nav drawer. So this is just the first place, this is just the list of counties. So basically it's just a list view of all the counties. And if we click on any of them, it brings into the Wikipedia page. Um, so, so it brings up to the Wikipedia page and does that for all the counties as well. Um, and just to go back. So that's the list of counties. So next is the Bellows page. So the Bellows page, I use the swipe left and right. Um, so it's really just giving a description about the GA. Um, and so if I swipe left, which is across this way, um, it brings open more information and just the background picture of Copair. Um, if I swipe right to go back, and if I swipe right again, it um, goes back, it opens up just the background picture of the GA at the start. Um, I did install like a map that's very basic, it just shows where um, Co Park is in the map. So it's not location or anything. Um, also, in every home page, uh, sorry, in every page, I have um, a menu on the right to bring me back to where I want to go. So that brings me back to the home page. So, next is history. For history, it was fragments. So, basically, this is just the home page, and then just like I separated just hurling, just all time top 10 scores, and then football. Just all time top 10 scores. So I just done three kind of fragments the home one, the Harlem one, the football one. There's a home. Um, Harlem. I, I use the fragments for that. Um, I'm going to go back to the home page because I'll start from the home page every time. So then next is the winner. So you just use the search function. Um, most of this is done inside the one. So if you're just looking for a team, it shows it there. You know, it, it brings it up. Um, it's again up. So, I'll show you the page here. Bring you back to things. Um, so, what do you know? Okay, so next is the next thing I want to show is the quiz score. So, for this, I need. Um, Firebase. So I'm going to get the real time database. So as you can see, there are all the, the things loaded. So here, so if I go to the top there, it's like Peter Jones, and Peter Jones is here. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to show you um, how to create one. So I'll press that. So I'm just going to put. Um, uh, um, say he got a score of six, he or she, and then I just add the record, and you can see here it turned yellow, so it came up here, I think, down here. Yeah, so new address. So now I'm just gonna, I'm gonna delete one now. So I'm not gonna delete that one just to show you that I can delete the other ones. So I'll just click on this. Um, and just delete. And you see there, it went red. That's deleted. Uh, I can also update on this as well. So say I'll just click on my one there. Just say I got 
different score of so one seven so seven nine. So just press update. So you see it turned yellow here. So it's nine. So that updates. So that's the um the kind of scoreboards. Um so that all works. That's the list view there. Um so that's kind of quiz scores. So next is actually I'll show the um sign up. So sign up is for the authentic authentication. Um so if I wanted to create an account, I would say, okay, so I'm just gonna I think I've used this so create um I'm just gonna put create uh one two three so again if I don't type in six or more characters it won't allow me and if I leave the field I have validation saying that you need to um there's the account is created there um so so that came up there I need to refresh that um so yeah there it is there here so to log into my account Three. Anyway, I'll be able to see. No, it's probably true. So that was wrong there, see, so it wouldn't let me go into the quiz. So it's good to show there. So it just says hello, create Gmail is logged in. So I'm logged into the quiz there. And I played this quiz before, and my high score was six. So I suppose I could just go through it really quick there. It's the same as kind of the sign one um, in questions, but again, I could add to it if I wanted to, but I just wanted to keep a template of it. Um, like, so I know how to add in that and just get everything around it first. Um, so that's just, so it didn't beat six, but um, it saves your high score. I have it saved to share preferences um, so that's that's login and sign up and that's authentication um, so you see there there are all the users you can delete any of them so next I'm going to show storage okay so storage I did try a couple of things I tried to upload PDFs so I was able to upload um, a PDF but what I wasn't able to do is download it again so what I done here in my app was I use um, <clears throat> as a gallery. So when you click on this, all the images um, that I've uploaded here come up on the screen. So I just only added this image here looks out of place because I basically just wanted to test that I can add and and if I add something to storage, it comes into this. So if you see all the pictures there. So what I'm going to do now is if I delete this, I think it's a long tail, see it there. So if I delete that, that won't be in it the next time. Or if I go to add a picture, that'll be in it the next time. So I suppose I'll just try to back here and I just want to stop it and load it again and um, so it's stopped now so if I just delete this so I'm gonna start it again um yeah. so it'll take it doesn't take too long but basically just the fact that I can add and delete images that are stored on Firebase. I have it connected to the um, the app. So you're gonna see the splash screen again, um, back into homepage. So we'll go down to gallery 
Um, and you shouldn't see the, uh, the bronze tail picture this time. And it's not there. It's gone. So if I was to add that again, it would come back up um, on the list view. So that works well. Um, so yeah, that's my app. They're just kind of a use a nav drawer. Um, yeah, that's basically it. I just I try to um, get Google sign in, but there was a I couldn't fully get it, so I didn't use maps or favorites because I didn't think it would fit in my app, so I left it out. I just tried to keep it simple and use what I could in it. Um, um, that's that's my app. Thanks very much for listening. Bye.